Hello and welcome to the session. I am Shashi and I am going to help you with the following question. Question says, find the probability of getting 5 exactly twice in 7 throws of a die. Let us now start with the solution. Now clearly we can see, repeatedly throwing of a die 7 times are Bernoulli trials. So we can write, repeated throws of a die are Bernoulli trials. We know Bernoulli trials are finite in number. They are independent. They have exactly two outcomes that is success or failure and the probability of success remains same in each trial. So, throw of a tie seven times are Bernoulli trials. Now, let us assume that X denotes number of five in an experiment of seven trials. Now, X has binomial distribution with N is equal to 7 and P is equal to 1 upon 6. We know probability of getting 5 in a single throw of a die is equal to 1 upon 6. We know total outcomes favorable to 5 is equal to 1 and total number of possible outcomes is equal to 6. So probability of getting 5 in a single throw of dice is 1 upon 6 and also probability of failures that is probability of not getting 5 in a single throw of dice is equal to 1 minus 1 upon 6 which is further equal to 5 upon 6. Now we know for binomial distribution B and P probability of X successes is equal to NCX multiplied by Q raised to the power N minus X multiplied by P raised to the power X where X is equal to 1 to n. Now we have to find the probability of getting 5 exactly twice in 7 throw of a die. So number of successes is equal to 2. So value of this x is equal to 2. Now total number of trials is equal to 7. So value of n is equal to 7. Value of x is equal to 2. We know value of Q is equal to 5 upon 6. So we will substitute 5 upon 6 for Q. And here we will write 7 minus 2. We know here N is equal to 7 and X is equal to 2. Now probability of getting 5 is equal to 1 upon 6. So, we will substitute 1 upon 6 for P here and we will write 2 for X. Now, this is further equal to 7 multiplied by 6 upon 2 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 5 upon 6 raised to the power 5 multiplied by 1 upon 36. We know Square of 6 is 36 and square of 1 is 1. 7 minus 2 is equal to 5. Now simplifying further, we get, we will cancel common factor 2 here. We get 21 upon 36 multiplied by 5 upon 6 raised to the power 5. 
Now again we will cancel common factor 3 from numerator and denominator both and we get 7 upon 12 multiplied by 5 upon 6 raised to the power 5 is equal to probability of getting two successes. So this is our required answer. This completes the session. Hope you understood the solution. Take care and have a nice day.